Hello ladies and gentlemen, Campbell Soups once again. Um, I do want to make a couple of apologies before we get into this video. Um, the first one, I do want to apologize about the whole, um, if you guys hear the TV in the background and if you guys also heard um, a bit of voices in the, uh, also in the background while I'm doing the update video, I do apologize for um, both of those. And yes, we were watching a TV show and I didn't turn the volume down uh, low enough. So um, I do want to apologize for that. The second thing is that I know in my previous video I did say I was going to get started on the Speed Rush TV Challenge uh, Season 4. But not just yet because after I really ended the last video, I just found out that the limited time series for the Audi TT RS Coupe was available. So we're going to do this one first and then we'll get started on the Speed Rush TV Challenge. So a um, couple things I do want to apologize for that. So I already did the introduction. You guys already know the rules. Hit that like, hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell so you guys can notify when I upload new content. And with that said, let's get into it. Okay, something uh, simple. So we got a head-to-head -head at the new Bugatti circuit at Le Mans. Elimination at the new Formula E Berlin circuit. And no burgering. 15 tiers as usual. Here are the rewards, which is actually pretty good. I actually like these rewards. I think the last one from the last update was a bit better, but this is okay. Let's do the head to head first. Yeah, again, I just decided to hit like do the download all assets so like that way you know in the next few videos we're not stuck having to wait on downloads and downloads all right let's check out the customizations which should be like everything actually from this one compared to the i believe the 2013 one it's pretty much the same, but like there's just a few little tweaks to this car. The uh, blue's okay. Not really a fan of white cars to be honest. The silver is pretty is pretty good. Oh I definitely like the red. The red suits it very well. Hell, even yellow suits the car uh, very well. But for now, we'll stick with the black, the Betty black. And the upgrade should be pretty cheap. Yeah, upgrades are cheap. And I am losing money, so I really have to do like a lot of races. Cause I think I, I think my highest point I was like at 41, 42 million. Now I'm literally down to 25, cause I haven't been doing a lot of races in Real Racing 3. So I need to get my money back up there, or else I'm gonna run out of money and don't have money for cash upgrades. Oh wow, that's new. That sucks that he got rid of the John Lotto though.
Now let's try out the Formula E Berlin circuit. I'm expecting a few tight squeezes as usual. I think they said this, um, this track is around, um, it's either in or around uh, Berlin or Foreign. I'm not even going to bother trying to pronounce the full name. passing area. Oh, yeah, it's an airport hangar. So we're definitely in the airport. I mean, I will admit, this one we keep track is actually a bit bigger than the previous ones. Like the, the one in Japan and New York were tight. At least some um, with this one, you have a bit more room to navigate. Now in terms of the car, I mean I do so